When bellwether hard cider owner Bill Barton traveled throughout Europe with his wife in the 1980s, they noticed a booming business that was not yet popular in the United States. Hard cider was big in Europe at the time, and the Bartons wondered why it wasn't popular in the U.S. Now, more than 30 years later, the Bartons have been the proud owners of Bellwether for 17 years. With nearly 60 wineries and cideries in New York State alone, the Bartons say it's only natural that the industry will continue to grow. There wasn't any hard cider, or very little, so it couldn't get popular, and all of a sudden people started to make it. We had traveled in Europe in the mid-80s and run into a hard cider for our first exposure and were really impressed with it. I was doing other things in the software industry and got tired of that at some point and said, well, I'll give it a try. A significant increase in cideries has led to much more competition. Barton says he sees similarities between the cider and craft brewing industries. In recent years, craft breweries grew exponentially. After a few years, though, the craft brewery industry experienced a sharp decline once competition grew. Barton says the cider industry could see a similar fate. Everybody and his brother seems to be wanting to open a cidery. So I think, yes, I think you're going to see an increase, but I think, I think you're also then going to see a collapse. As production slows because of harsh weather conditions, so does business. Barton says there are many days that can go by without a single customer. While the Finger Lakes region experienced a mild winter this year, the Bellwether owners said business surprisingly did not pick up. Oftentimes in the winter, you get almost no business during the week. And this year, I would have, I would have expected a little bit more business. Mm -hmm. But now that the weather has improved, business is beginning to pick up. Barton says that just this past week, he's seen an increase from only one to two customers a day to anywhere from 10 to 20. From now until late fall, cideries will be among the most popular activities in the Finger Lakes region. For ICTV, I'm Nick Fooster.